Hi guys, welcome to the unboxing quick review of this Yolosk solar charger with a whopping 36,000 milliamp charge. It has also built-in QI wireless charger, it has built-in four cables, it has in total three inputs and six output possibilities has even a light and a solar panel to charge this thing just from the sun so i think this is the most versatile power bank which i've ever seen so let's take it out of the box and see what we get and how this works so it arrives nicely protected and here we have it comes even with these instructions manual but of course it's not very difficult to use it's pretty straightforward here we have the specs again i hope you can see that other than that i'm going to show you everything in detail anyway here we get also free carabiner hook and of course we need a mount for the carabiner hook so we can just open this thing and then we have the handle here for the hook very nice what we have here is also this button and we can see then the charge it shows the charge in 25 percent steps so we have 25 50 75 or even 100 percent when we have even this led here so we have now 75 percent and here on the left side we see a green light here even inside and when i bring a light a little bit closer i hope you can see that now when i'm using this artificial light you can see we have this green light here on this side and that means that it is now charging so it doesn't only charge from full sun outside it will also charge here from such artificial light but of course from the sun it's much stronger charge but what i recommend is not to rely on full solar charge i mean this would take about a week or so at least uh, if you would leave it in full sun and uh, try to fully charge because the capacity is so high here and you have always have to make sure that it's not overheating so if you're planning to charge it from the sun with this solar panel i highly recommend to lift it up maybe put it on something like uh, if you're outside put it on some branches or rocks or so that you get uh, some nice ventilation underneath you really have to prevent some overheating don't leave it just like flat in full sun otherwise it will overheat and then you do not only have very low efficiency but it's also a risk that it overheats and could take some damage and this would be very bad because this is a really nice power bank by the way when we long press here we get also this nice light here you can see it has two lights this is something which i highly appreciate a lot of such power banks they have just one and then when you are alone out in the woods and you need the thing and maybe you drop it and then one gets damaged and you don't have uh, any light anymore so this is much better i highly recommend to only buy such things which have two lights and then when we long press we can turn it off again and of course what we also have is this nice protection almost everywhere this is very strong very durable you can also see a, a lot of screws here this is very nice and so it's also quite a bit of water protected but of course not intended for submerging but it has really nice protection then regarding the charging options we have here this wireless charger then we have four times these usb cables they are nicely protected so it needs quite a bit to open that but it's not impossible you can do that even with your fingernails you don't need like a tool or so and so now we have all of them here you can see three times output here we have a micro usb we have usb c which provides up to three amps and here we have even lightning adapter for apple products and here we have a full size usb which we can use to charge this power bank on every standard size usb a outlet this is very convenient so i can show you that here pretty quickly we just plug it in you can see 
now it is charging directly from any kind of uh, normal size USB A outlet very very convenient so when you buy this power bank you usually don't have to deal with any kind of USB cables anymore you don't have to carry extra cables around and you have something for all the phones tablets uh, for everything this is super convenient and after you have been using them just put them down here uh, at the right place so we have them now properly stored again now let's check on the wireless charge which is 5 watts we have to activate this here we get the green light and so I put my phone here and so we adjust the position till we get a flashing green light now we have this here and we will see the charge indicator also on my phone absolutely awesome and I mean this thing here is a super thick rugged phone with an extra case and not many wireless chargers are able to charge my phone this one is capable to do that so we have a very powerful uh, wireless charger as well and then of course we have here these openings as well here we have USB A output USB C input and output and micro USB input so in total we have these three possibilities for input here we have input here we have input and also here we have input and we have six type of output we have one two three four five and six with the wireless so absolutely amazing i have never seen such a thing before and on top of that we have the solar panel charging option and this is not only powerful in the listing it's also very powerful in real life you can see the power here you can see six watts here and we can increase that so with three amps we should have 15 watts so let's see how much we can get here I increase that and we definitely have 15 watts and so let's go even a little bit higher because it has really nice protection here built in uh, protection for almost everything uh, protection against overcharge overcurrent uh, over voltage overheating and everything and you can see when we go above the maximum of 3 amps means more than 15 watts you can see that in a sudden it stops and we have to activate it again or go a little bit lower with the consumption so this is exactly how we want it absolutely awesome this thing has really everything what we need so i can highly recommend it and so i'll put down the link to the amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and order drive from there if you like it and i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching see you next time